Hello and welcome back to episode 9 of my Minecraft Let's Play series. Today we're going to be going on a bit of an adventure slash exploration to go and see what this weird area is I've seen on the map. So obviously we're here and there is something interesting looking here. Some sort of pyramid thing I guess. So I feel like we should go and check that out. There's also a nice looking village, something here as well, some sort of bridge, various things in the ocean, which, yeah, I'm not even sure what those things are, to be honest. But I thought we'd start off by sailing across here, maybe having a look at these things, but probably not. I need something to breathe underwater, I think. Um, checking this out and maybe going to these villages. So yeah, let's head off. I'll quickly show you some progress I made. I bought this from a wandering trader. I don't even know what it is or what it does. I mean, it's showing me my coordinates, isn't it? So maybe that's its use. Maybe it's just to hold it and use it. But obviously I've got the mini map, which I guess it's kind of cheating. Um, I don't remember what I've done. So I have enchanted. I made two pickaxe, two diamond pickaxes because I enchanted one with a level thirty, and it had, um, it had efficiency, unbreaking, but then it had um, silk touch, which I never really use. So I then got another diamond pickaxe, enchanted that, and it had fortune. And then I combine them together on the anvil to make this one. Um, so yeah, that's it. So I've, I've done two level 30 enchantments now. I'm back to level 23. And I've also finished off this mine. So we can quickly zoom down here. When I say finished off, I mean the uh, rail sort of system. I did find... Well, annoyingly, I actually... When I still have my silk touch pickaxe, I found some diamond. One one spot, I found 14 diamonds in one place, which was very strange. I don't know if that's more common nowadays. But I found 14 diamond all in one place with just the normal pickaxe, but you know, with a silk touch, so there was still the ore. But then, stupidly, I you know went back upstairs, placed them down, and just mined them with a normal pickaxe. And then straight after that, I made the fortune pickaxe and realised I should have done it with that. <laughs> but um, we still have quite a collection of diamonds anyway, because as you can see, I've done quite a bit of uh, you know, uh, strip mining, vein mining, whatever you call it. And there's this weird area down here that I don't know what it is. It's like, uh, I guess I, I just added these chests here, They're all, these ones are empty, just to start collecting things. And I was going to open this up around here. But yeah, a lot of these parts were very lava. Lavery, <laughs> that's the word. So it was, it was getting annoying, so I was, was thinking I'd go back this way, where it was a bit clearer, and then start going side by side. But yeah, down here, um, I'll show you quickly. Maybe, maybe someone can help me out and tell me what this is. <coughs> I mean, it's related to that... Um, is it Skulk or Sulk? I can't remember what it was called. Skulk. Oh, is this weird cave thing? And, uh... Yeah, I know this stuff like, gives me XP. But I'm not even sure if I'm supposed to mine it. And... Yeah, there are those weird like sensors and catalysts and stuff. And I was kind of running around. I was using my bucket to make obsidian to get across here. Um, and then I was just kind of looking around and then all of a sudden my screen was going really dark and all sorts of creepy noises were appearing so I got scared and ran off <laughs> but I didn't know, I'm not even sure what that, what that is so if someone can fill me in on what well, yeah, what Skulk is and if I'm supposed to mine that stuff if it's like a good way of getting levels or um, and what that cave is, am I supposed to explore it? Are there any monsters in there that are going to kill me? <laughs> but yeah if you'd let me know, that'd be good. Um, 
but yeah, this, uh, I finished off this with the powered rails. It feels like it's only just powerful enough to get me up <laughs> this hill um, with this amount of the powered rails. Maybe I'll add some more at some point when I get more gold, uh, but I was running low. So I kind of used as, l as little as I could. I got another mod, as you can see, that automatically goes into F5 mode in certain cases, like when you're getting minecarts and boats and things, which is quite nice. Um, yeah, obviously you finish those bookcases off, which we had loads of from the villagers right at the start of the series. Um, why is there anything else? I, I, I've got a... Oh, I say I've got... Did I even put it on? Uh, that's what I was supposed to be putting on. Yeah, I did. I used that vanilla tweaks resource pack thing um, where you can kind of build your own. So hopefully, so the fences look slightly different. Some things are randomized, like the bookcases are randomized. <coughs> Pardon me. Um, grass textures and stuff like that should be random. <coughs> oh, I got my throat. <laughs> Um, you can see these are like more 3D, the rails, and uh, the glass is slightly nicer, cleaner looking. Um, doors are more 3D looking. And yeah, there's, there's a bunch of other stuff that it may, mainly sort of minor little tweaks, as the name suggests. You, oh yeah, more of a dark mode inventory, which I think suits the channel nicely and numbers so I can use my number keys to jump between items a bit easier. Um, Actually, I think I'm going to grab some bones just in case we see some wolves. Actually, yeah, this is the diamonds as <laughs> of so 44, doing quite well. And tons of iron, obviously, from the, the automated iron farm. Uh, yeah, a bunch of iron tools in there. I'm running out of space in my farming chest, so I've moved some stuff to here. Um... Trying to think if anything else will be useful on this trip. Probably an axe, in case we need to chop any wood down. You can see some of these textures are slightly different now. Um, I've got a load of food, that should be okay. Uh, is it worth bringing anything else? Do you think? Hmm. Maybe... I'll definitely bring an axe. Let's do that first before I forget. Bring. Glitchy looking. That must be one of my resource pack things I've. I'll try and fix that next time. Oh, we got some rain. A dark sky. Let's. Is my boat still down here? It is, nice. I should probably bring a spare boat, shouldn't I? That would probably be smart. Well, we'll survive, hopefully. Um, okay, let's head off then. Ooh, those keys are reversed, that's weird. Alright, off we go. Yeah, I do vaguely remember at least reading about I think they were called ocean monuments that was way you know way past when I stopped playing so I, I don't know anything about them but I, I, th I think I've seen videos of people um, with some weird giant fish monster things and having to try and kill them with uh, like spears and stuff yeah this looks scary are these going to go after me feel like that's for another day. Don't know if these are going to try and get me. Okay, that, this doesn't look good. Let's, <laughs> let's stay away from that for now. Whatever that was. One second. I had an intrusion in my room. Um, what, where were we? Can't 
fully remember. Yeah, I, I think I was talking about the Ocean Monument stuff. I, I think I've seen uh, some videos pop up on YouTube a while ago about it and some giant puffer fish looking things and all that, but I, yeah, I, I know nothing about it, so I feel like that's one to research before blindly swimming down there <laughs> and getting destroyed. So what's that under me now? Uh, me. Oh, something in there. Look. Okay, that also doesn't look very friendly. What are, are they? Like zombies. Yeah, I really uh, I need to look into some of these newer features, newer updates, because I, I have no idea about any of them, and there's so many now. Okay, that's... What is that? Is that the place we're going? I do like this... Uh, I've used a slightly uh, clearer water texture, I think. Why should we park up? Or dock? Wow, this is cool. Right, the boat's right next to here, so we shouldn't lose it on the northwest side of this thing. Let's have a little look around first. And of course, it's getting dark. Very dark. Look the flies. Is there an entrance to this place? Should we just break into it? Oh. oh. Are they like stags or deer or whatever? They live here? <laughs> Why is it switching to that? And why is my health so low? <laughs> oh god. Get rid of that. It keeps switching to that by accident. And I probably have a shield on shouldn't I? But I don't have uh Why's my health? Okay, so it's definitely unfriendly people around here. Let's have a look around carefully. Oh, there we go. they do a lot of damage, don't they? Feel like I need to switch to that. Even though I can barely see now. Is that like a prison cell? Oh, okay. What is that? Some weird... What is that? Ally. I don't even know what they are. Never seen one of those before. This looks 
promising. Oh, someone in there somewhere. Maybe. Oh, why is my shield? Where's my shield gone? What's happening? Oh god. Oh god. Oh, what? Oh no. My shield wasn't going up. What happened? Right. That did not go well. At all. Uh... Right, we're going to need another boat. Probably some torches so we can actually see. And let's sleep, actually. That's probably a good plan, isn't it? Wow. Well, that didn't go well. Those Vindicators, whatever they were called, do a lot of damage. Sorry, I just realised I'm <laughs> munching on ice down the mic. Hopefully that didn't come through too loud. So I think... Oh, look at these puddles. <laughs> oh, I'm so... Oh, a nice rainbow. I'm pleased very easily, as I think I said before. Let's leave one here. I think I can... I thought I could drag these around. Maybe I didn't get that mod, I forgot. Okay, yeah, I, I, I think there should be a gravestone where I died. But I'm not entirely sure how that works. from those weird things. Yeah, I, I didn't realise how much damage those people did. They took, basically, like, even with my armour on, it was, what was it, like half my health in one, one hit? <laughs> and then my shield wasn't, I was holding right click and my shield wasn't going up. Like a village down there. Like an underwater village or something. Yes, this is gonna be uh I didn't quite think this through getting my stuff, did I? How am I gonna get back in there without getting killed? There's some big butterflies, aren't they? <laughs> hmm. Maybe I should... Let's leave this one here. Maybe I should collect some wood and make a pickaxe. I should have brought some iron tools, that was stupid of me. You know, and sort of drill through the wall. Maybe we'll just run in there crazily and see what happens. What could go wrong? The door was this side, wasn't it? Like up all the way around. And there's my boat. My other boat. Yeah, so let's not underestimate those vindicator people. I thought I was quite safe with my shield and, and armour. Apparently not. Alright, so it was on the right. Oh, I thought that was one of them. 
Or is it? No. Yeah, right around the side then. Um. So I assume that guy's still in there. Ready to jump me. There. Can I sneak? Is that does that work on this? Okay, that's a dead end. I does sneaking work on monsters? Nope. Jesus, he's fast. Okay. <laughs> oh god. Oh god. Dead end. Just what I wanted. Great. <laughs> yep, yep, yep. Yep, yep, yep. Okay. This could be challenging. I feel like I'm going to need to do some play this smart and drill my way in and kind of block areas off just to try and get my stuff back. I mean, my pickaxe is the main thing I'm uh, scared of losing. Where did that come from? Oh, I brought those. Great. <laughs> that was when I was making the boat, wasn't it? Alright, let's... Let's collect some wood. Grab a load of this, make it into planks so I've got stuff to place, and then make a pickaxe or a couple. So yeah, make a bunch of that. Make some of these. Make some of these. Stuff. Okay. Of course, I've got the worst food possible that heals absolutely nothing. Okay, so. That was the entrance side, I think. And my things were around the right hand side. I wonder how long my grave lasts as well. ready. So my, was I over there? Is that a be better side to go from? 
Maybe it was. Why is my hunger going down so quickly all the time? I'll be sad if I lose that pickaxe. helpful isn't it for now <laughs> where's my stuff Is it around there? This one's friendly. <laughs> okay, where did he come from? What? Oh no. <laughs> Oh no, God, this is not going well. <sighs> Where did he even come from? Right, we need a plan. And a better plan than that one. visitor then. Um, actually, let's bring those. And we placed a spare boat down, didn't we? Put that back in there. Okay, right. They are very fast. Very fast. I'm sprinting around apparently. I mean, a shield doesn't seem much help, so. Guess we keep. blocks to use as building blocks or to try and hide. Um, yeah, let's see. So we have two, potentially two gravestones depending on how that works. Hopefully my first one hasn't sort of disappeared. Hmm. 
Hmm, I imagined it. I thought I had another boat there. I still only have one cow. <laughs> uh, wood, wood, wood. I'll keep those planks on me. Just in case. one there and I'll use one. Off we go again. Oops. Alright, this this video really <laughs> really hasn't gone to plan. It was only one of the first videos where I actually had a plan. To go and explore and not die. That didn't go well. Died twice. The first first Oh yeah, first time in the series was today. And I in the uh, in the first series I didn't die once. Well I mean I didn't ever come against these guys. <laughs> oh, that's really really frustrating. I'm not even sure where that guy came from. I thought the room we were in was safe. Maybe there wasn't enough light and he spawned in, maybe? Or he was just hiding somewhere? And then, and then I tried to make a tower underneath me. You know, you know just to, to get safe, but yeah, that didn't work. I really don't know about this gravestone system, if, if there's like an expiry on them or something. I really do hope I've not lost my pickaxe of all those enchantments are. I would like to have a look through some of those chests, especially that room with loads of them in. Imagine how much stuff might be there. If just one chest we looked in had a diamond plate body and other things. So I feel like every time we go here I go to the wrong place. If the entrance is around that side I run a... so it should be here then, should it? This corner? This should be where my f first death was, shouldn't it? that for a second and To get rid of all these things that I, that I don't need right now. I think that's my. <laughs> my head. <laughs> oh god. Let's just think about this. So 
so... So now, my other loot might be somewhere around here. Is that a chest room? Let's just keep having a look around. Try and figure this out. Okay, so I ran around. Okay, ran around here. So it must be on this other side then. It must be somewhere over here. Is it there? Oh, is it there? <laughs> Alright, let's do that. And that. There's the two yellow ones. Let's go check those first. There are multiple floors as well. Some sort of farm in there. Where was that chest room? Is it that one? Is that it? That was it, wasn't it? Did he get up there? Mm. 
So was this the room? Oh, this is a different one. seem like lower value chests, don't they? Bunch of these quivers. There we go. Move some of this stuff. Got my pickaxe back. Relatively successful, then, isn't it? Do we risk? Oops. Do we risk more looking around? Is the question. Let's put that back there. I think these chests just don't have much in, do they? Those scary guys in there. <laughs> Lots of scary guys there. should get back. Don't you? That sounds like a good plan to me. Get back. Get some of this stuff safe.
Oh, well, that wasn't a complete disaster. We did find... some things. <laughs> I mean, not much. Basically diamond armour. And a quiver. A couple of emeralds. So yeah, it wasn't really worth it, was it? But we didn't really have much of a look around. I feel like that's... That's one of those ally things I released. <laughs> I wonder what they do. Yeah, I feel like I need to properly be kitted out next time I go there. That was way too easy to get killed. And I think, can you, when you enchant a helmet, is one of them like breathing underwater? Have I imagined that? But it would be fun to go and explore some of these places as well. I should probably make more diamond armor. Something weird down there as well. Very dark. Very, very dark. mod where I can like drag these but <laughs> apparently not very well leave it there okay so it wasn't a complete disaster we did we did save most of our stuff as well. Is that a new one? Did we find that? That's good. Yeah, that's, uh, well, that's, that's something. <laughs> I do like leads. Does he still have his on? Yeah, he does. Okay, that's something. We grow some melons actually. Let's go and put some of this stuff back. Cauldron. Harvesting. Oh. 
Well, that did work. That might actually. Is that just replanting it? Oh, that's just replanting the same thing, isn't it? Yeah, I got a right click harvest planting mod thing. But it's. Uh, it replants the same thing for you. But I do want some watermelons. There we go. lost all my levels, didn't I? Oh, that's annoying. At least I wasn't too high. Is bread two or is it three? There we go. Let's go and, um... read my farm. I feel like I need a larger area for them. I feel quite bad for that little tiny area. <laughs> he get in there? Mystery. Uh. Oh, there's loads of pigs in. Pigs have got everywhere. Probably because they have no space. really go to plan but it was decent fun in the end I should probably make one of those compost I think shouldn't I to get some bone meal use up some of this some of these supplies um, I think I'll leave that there for this video so thank you for watching as always and I hope you enjoyed Drop me a comment if you have any feedback or if you can answer any of the 50 questions I asked. That would be very useful. And uh, see you again soon. Bye.